Vito Melfi teeing off. That's a baby. But Melfi's teeing off on something besides the eighth hole these days. He says he's tired of seeing people parade around his city's golf course in clothing more suited to the beach. To Melfi, a former city commissioner and now a golf advisory board member, proper attire on the fairways is serious business. There's a moral obligation for every golfer to wear something. You just can't walk out on the course with a halter and a, ba and a, and a bathing suit. It, it just doesn't, to me, it's not right. Melfi and the golf board got commissioners to pass a dress code. So from now on here, bathing suits, tank tops, bare tops, and bare feet are all off limits. The signs are already posted prominently around the pro shop. Bill Martin, a starter, has to enforce the code, and he's concerned about enforcement. Between uh, between you and I, it, it's very, very hard to enforce, I would say. But some outfits clearly don't make par in Pompano Beach anymore. The course manager judged this man's bathing suit inappropriate. Regulars at Pompano Beach think the restrictions aren't aimed at them anyway. Mostly it's the snowboards, you know, when they come down and uh, that they would would dress different than we do. And the penalty for dress code non-compliance, you can't play here. Any serious golfer would consider that penalty enough. In Pompano Beach, Steve Bosquet, Channel 10 Eyewitness News.